Hi everybody, it's the Soap Man and it's time to make some soap. So I'm testing a new fragrance from Brambleberry. It's new to me, that is. It's been around with Brambleberry for years. I have never used Brambleberry's version of black raspberry vanilla. Just about every fragrance supplier has this and they're all a little different. Brambleberry's is definitely unique. To me, it has a smell of coffee. Not strong coffee, but it smells like coffee to me. It smells good, but it smells like coffee. And my wife and my daughter both agree, if you sniff it for a long time, you start to get some of the sweet notes. So really strange. I'm curious about that one. Just an update on the last two. A couple of weeks ago, I did one um, apple bourbon holding up really well. I really like it. This is dark and maybe ever so slightly, just barely noticeable. I would definitely buy that one again, definitely use it. And then the one I wasn't sure about because all of this brown is natural from the frost from the fragrance. I didn't put any brown at all and it took a long time to develop. Now that it's fully brown, I'm not so against this soap. And it had a really harsh chemical smell, but a couple of weeks later, it actually smells really nice right now. This was Pacific Trail. So both of these I'm really happy with, and I do believe I would buy again. So for today's black raspberry vanilla, I'm going to be pretty simple. Do a drop swirl with a hanger swirl using Nurture Soap's Purple Vibrance and Nurture Soap's Raspberry Red along with some titanium dioxide for the white. I'm going to hang or swirl that and on the frosting I'm going to two-tone the red and the pink. So give me a little while to get set up and I'll be back. Okay, so I believe we are ready. So I stick blended this just to a very barely emulsified trace, or I should say just a bare emulsion, bare bones emulsion, because I think in the past when I was just hand stirring it and then stick blending it at the last minute, I think I was having false trace, because it was just doing some weird things, especially the frosting. It looked to me like it was separating. So here we have our raspberry red. Give it a good stir and it looks great. And here we have our purple vibrance. And it looks great. Dioxide white. I did go ahead and pre mix this this time. I don't always, especially in the smaller batches, but I did this time. And the stick blending, of course, will really lighten that up and brighten it up. So let's go ahead and get our fragrance in. I'm going to take a chance and just stick blend this right in because this fragrance is well known for behaving well among all the carriers that supply it. Hope I'm not sorry. I might stir it at first. And I know I can use this whole bottle, so we'll save that for a frosting. Maybe I will just hand stir this at first just to be extra safe, but this has to be stick blended one more time. Yeah, no issues. As I suspected. No issues at all. So let's give it a quick buzz to fully emulsify everything and brighten up this TD. Much better, nice, very nice. I got my 
hammer tool right here in front of me. Hopefully I don't forget, because I am known to do that. Okay, you know the drill, that's about to sit, but while that's firming up, I'll do a little cleanup off camera and get the frosting mixed up and I'll be back.
All right, I'm back and it's time to cut our soap. And the soap behaved much better this time. I had been just hand stirring it and then stick blending it just as I was getting ready to pour it and I think I was, was achieving false trace because I was having several instances where it separated and the frosting was clumpy and this time frosting was perfect consistency. The pour went well. So I guess I won't be doing that anymore and that's exactly what I was expecting. A nice bright white and nice swirled. Nice multicolor. I intentionally did these colors a little bit lighter than the inside so there was a little bit of contrast. <clears throat> right now this has a bit of a chemical smell and that smell is very familiar. I've noticed that in a lot of fragrances so I'm not really worried. We'll see in four weeks what it smells like. So yeah, the soap did exactly what I was hoping. Let me just make it that. Soap did exactly as I was hoping it would. <clears throat> and only time will tell with the fragrance uh, how well it sticks. But so far, I am really happy with this. And that's what I have for this week. So as always, stay safe, take good care of yourselves, and be blessed. Bye, everybody.